Hello everyone and welcome back. It's me, Sylvia. And in today's project, I have this lovely phone case for you. So let's get started. For this project, I'll be using my favorite cotton yarn, but you can use any yarn you like, of course. Also, you will need some scissors. I'll be using um, 3.5 millimeter hook, also yarn needle and you will need a button. I'll be using this lovely butterfly button. So we are going to start with the slip knot. Wrap the yarn around your two fingers like so and create a cross. Go under your first one on top of the second one, pull it down and twist your hook to secure and release. Okay, I am going to chain 12 for my phone but every phone is different so you chain as many as you need so i have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve okay, okay. and i'm going to measure it on my smartphone because i'm using my phone to record this video <laughs> And it's not enough okay so um we'll need 13 14 maybe and we're gonna measure it just like this and this should be just perfect so measure it on your phone and come back Once you are done with your chain we are going to do three single crochet into this second stitch here so second one from your hook not counting this one here we're gonna do three single crochet into this one here so insert your hook wrap the yarn around your hook pull through and the yarn over again and do this three times we go one two and three don't make your stitches too loose or too tight okay and now we are going to single crochet into the next stitch here and the same into the next one and all the way down in every single stitch and then before we get there I am to show I am going to show you what to do next okay so go all the way down doing single so crochet I have my last two stitches here and single crochet And into this last one here, we are going to do three, okay? So insert your hook, do single crochet one, and again to the same stitch, single crochet again, and again, single crochet. So we have three on this side as well. And now we are going to work into this loop here this first one so insert your hook and do single crochet into this first loop okay into this one here so put this loop insert your hook yarn over and do single crochet and we are going to do this all the way down in all these loops go under like so you know one and do single crochet all the way down like so and the next one only under the loop don't go through both okay like this 
so all the stitches every single stitch single crochet all the way around and it's gonna curl in and that's perfectly normal okay because that's what we want really so i came back and as you can tell this is my first stage i'm gonna do single crochet one more time here and i won't be slip stitching or anything or chaining anything i'm just simply going to carry on into the next stage here and into the next one and into the next one until you reach around the of course you need to grab your phone and measure it so you won't see your phone so i would recommend if my phone is 14 centimeters i would recommend to go around 15 centimeters but it's up to you, you can have like just like your phone so let's do 14 centimeters so guys look at this it's looking amazing let me just get this off and let's insert the phone in and you should get something like this just exactly perfect you can have it higher if you want but it's up to you really and the base is looking amazing and there are no seams you see it's because we were working into a spiral all the way around like so so they just finished so once you got your desired size i am going to simply slip stitch let's do it somewhere in the middle and then i show you why okay so i'm going to i need to get somewhere in the middle somewhere here so i need to remove stitches more stitches get into the middle here somewhere right here I'm right in the middle and I am going to simply slip stitch just like this to close my ground And close simple so once we have closed our round we are going to attach our our button somewhere here so thread your needle make a knot just like so a knot and at your button somewhere i would say maybe five centimeters from the top so i just insert and at your button And one more time and you finish your button so it's nice and strong finish it with a nice knot with a nice knot here one, two, 
to maybe hand me down need a nice knot and this one that's from then how did that get here okay okay so we got our button and now let's do the clothing so for the clothing we are going to leave a longer yarn tail maybe five centimeters create a slip knot and chain really tight chains so really nice and tight stitches just like this really nice and tight really really tight and let's measure if it's enough And we're gonna attach it somewhere here so this should go all the way down around our button like this and we're gonna attach it on the top but on the opposite side so we're gonna attach it here so i think i need my chain few stitches along so once you are done with your chain and you are happy with the closing i think this should be just perfect for me so fast enough like this and we are going to fold it in half like so and we need to attach it here okay but we are going to attach it from the outside so turn your case like this take your second row one side in like this and then this side here like two or one to two centimeters apart and make sure it's nice and in the middle so let's we'll just do it somewhere here like this and then simply make a knot let me just fold it like this so we can see this we're gonna hide in a minute so let's just do a knot here nice and tight and one one more time there we go and we can simply cut it off or you can hide it with a need them i'm going to cut it off because it's really small and you don't really see when it's inside and i'm going to hide this end i'm going to hide this end here and out simply just like day cut it off and close your pouch really unique <laughs> and really cute i really love these tiny little projects and really fast so perfect opening and closing it's a different Into your phone and 
clothes perfect for the hand, handbags <laughs> really cute i hope you liked my video please don't forget to subscribe for more videos and more ideas from sylvia thank you very much for watching and have a good day